back in Mexico when I was studying Chinese over there, I had a picture of the bond in my computer. And I said to myself, someday I will be there. For sure I will be there, I have to go there. Um, my name is Pilar Mejia Buenfil. I am from Mexico and I have been in Shanghai for almost five years. The first time I came to Shanghai was like a dream because I spent a, such a long time in the flight and it took me more than 20 hours to actually arrive to Shanghai. So I was really tired. I just couldn't believe that I was here for like two or three days until I went out and experienced the city for the first time. The place I was seeing in front of my eyes was really more beautiful than the one I saw have in my, in my computer. Like I just was so happy and I just stayed there for like two hours just the bond and all the buildings and the people and everything because actually in Mexico City we don't have this kind of so I arrived here to study first so one year of the language and then the three years of the master. So I have been doing my research on the history of Chinese photography. Uh, I have seen quite a lot of pictures in different books, archives, articles. From seeing the first pictures up from 100 years ago in the 19th century, in the 20th century, until now, I have seen that Shanghai has complete change. It's not the same at all. Right now, you see the city and it's just like, like such a modern city, like you still can feel the history, you can still feel the culture and everything. Everything you see, it's also very modern. Like technology, is like, Shanghai is a city with lots of technology everywhere. Like, so it's, for me, it's really amazing. When I was doing my research, I was like, okay, no, this is not the same city, how come? Like if, if you have no knowledge about it, maybe say like, no, this is not the same city. This is just completely another city because it changed a lot and it changed for good. And because I have heard from my friends that the Import Expo is such a big event that it's like, you have to go and see it, like for sure. The things they were describing to me was like, there will be a lot of people that you may probably not be able to move a lot because there's so many people like going and looking and seeing what is happening, like not only in China, but with all the countries that have uh, this relationship with China. Import Expo is super important for China. So I just, when we got the notice that they were looking for volunteers to attend as part of the university, I decided to apply. It was like a really nice travel because I saw another another small city. It's not as big as Shanghai. I went to uh, Ulmuchi. I know it's a very important city because it's like the ones near the frontier with Russia and Pakistan and all these like Central Asia. All the things that surround Ulmuchi, like it's completely different. You, you can see that like the culture is there, like the the ethnic culture is really in there like i could go out and like in less than half an hour we were arriving into a place that is a desert that would not happen in my country or at least not in my city uh, so for me it was like the first time seeing the desert i was like oh my god there's so much sand i just can't can't i can't believe it so i spent a really nice time in xinjiang and i also learned a lot of the culture over there Yo amo Shanghai, hala, hushi, sahe, 